Hello everyone, welcome back. In this session, we are going to discuss about the uh, topic work. When we say that work is said to be done, we may heard this word work in general also. In general, we may think that doing a homework is a work and uh, doing any kind of uh, cooking or uh, doing any uh, kind of work con is considered as a work. But according to science, the work is said to be done when there is a force applied on any other body and there should be some displacement. If there is a force applied on a body and there is a displacement, then only the work is said to be done. So, uh, first let us see the definition of the work. Work is said to be done by a force. Definitely there should be a force. Uh, if the point of application of force undergoes displacement so due to the application of force the body have to displace either in the direction of either in the direction of force or in the direction of component of force see if you consider a body of mass or a block having a mass m uh, with the application of force here it has been displaced. So, a displacement is made by the uh, application of force on the block. So, as there is a force applied and there is a displacement uh, of the body, definitely we can say that the work is said to be done. And here, the work done may be uh, here see the movement of the body may be in the a direction of applied force or it may be in the direction of opposite to the force how the uh, displacement of the body will be in opposite direction see for example if you consider a car is moving uh, and due to the application of brakes it have been stopped so the what is the force uh, direction of brakes here see if the car is moving in this direction the direction of applied brakes will be in opposite direction but the displacement will be in this direction okay of course after some uh, few uh, minutes or few movements the car will stop and one more thing is uh, Component of force. When we will say this component of force, see if you consider a roller and it have been pulled in this direction, but the movement of the roller will be in this direction. It won't move along the direction of applied force. It will move in this direction. So here what we will consider is, we will consider the component of force. The component of force along the displacement or the component of force along the force applied. So we will consider an angle here. See so actually work done W equal to force. There should be application of force and there should be displacement. And here coming to the component of force. The work done will be F cos theta and into displacement. So we can uh, consider it as work is equal to F S cos theta. Here we know that the work done or work is a scalar quantity. See actually the force is a vector quantity and the displacement is also a vector and here the dot product of four, uh, a vector and a vector is a scalar so the work done is a scalar quantity and coming to the units the SI unit of work is see we know that uh, the work force unit is Newton and the displacement is meter so simply we can say that unit of work is newton meter or it can be calculated in terms of joule newton meter or joule 
and coming to the dimensional formula of work that is we know the force dimensional formula m l t power minus 2 and uh, distance l power 1 and what is one more here displacement so displacement as it is displacement is in terms of length we will get square here m l square t power minus 2 this is the dimensional formula and the unit is joule or newton meter so we can say like this 1 newton meter is equal to 1 joule and a work is a scalar quantity and when we will consider the component of work when the <coughs> force applied in one direction and the displacement is making some uh, angle with that then we can consider the work uh, as component of work and that, that means component of force or component of displacement so here if you consider this is the normal here and this is the 90 degrees to the uh, plane so if the angle is 90 or below 90 that means the force angle and displacement angle is below 90 the work done will be positive if the angle is more than 90 then the work done will be negative so let us see that first you consider that angle is 0 if the angle is 0 angle 0 means work w equal to fs cos theta no that means fs cos 0 that means we will get fs yes cos 0 equal to 1 work done will be maximum and when the angle is 0 when the angle is 0 in the sense the direction of force and the displacement will be in the same direction then the work done will be positive at this moment the work done will be positive and you consider one more situation when the angle is 180 degree if the angle is uh, 180 degree what happens work done w equal to fs cos 180 degree so fs cos 180 in the sense we will get minus so minus fs that means work done will be negative when we will get uh, such type of uh, uh, negative work that means uh, he, before only we have discussed the car brake example when we are uh, having the car brake if the car is moving and if you apply the brake the car will stop here the force of brakes applied is in opposite direction of the motion of the car so force direction is this one and car direction is this one so the angle between the two is 180 degrees the car motion is in this direction and the force of applied brakes is in this direction the angle is 180 degree then the work done will be negative and one more we can consider if you lift any block or a bag or any object from the floor if you are lifting up like this uh, what happens we are doing some work against the gravity and the direction of gravity is in this direction we are lifting it up so here uh, angle is 180 again here so the work done will be negative and the work done by us will be positive here here we you have to uh, uh, put that in mind very clearly that the work done by us is positive but the work done by the gravity is negative see as you are lifting any what we call any body or a heavy mass bag the work done by us is positive because the direction of applied force and the displacement of the bag is both in same direction but the work done by the gravity as the gravity will act vertically downward then we can observe this angle 180 degrees so the work done by the gravity is negative and work done by us is positive so when the angle is 180 degree the work done will be negative and final one when the angle is 90 degree the work done will be fs cos theta or cos 90 so cos 90 means 
विल गेट कॉस नाइंटी वैल्यू कॉस नाइंटी इज जीरो सो विल गेट दैट वर्क इज जीरो वेन वी वेन वी कैन ऑब्जर्व दिस सी इफ यू कंसिडर अवर दिस इज द ऑर्बिट of the earth and here there is sun here the planet is moving in this direction consider like that and the gravitational force by the sun is in this direction so this is 90 degrees between the uh, what you call uh, displacement of the what you call uh, earth and force applied so as it is 90 here the work done by the uh, gravitational force is zero here gravitational force is zero and one more uh, we can consider see consider a coolie uh, coolie carrying a heavy load and he, he is walking that means uh, here he is displacing the heavy load also but here the work done by the uh, gravity will be zero here reason is this is the direction of displacement and this is the direction of gravity direction of displacement is in this direction and gravity is downward direction the angle is 90 degree so the work done by the gravity is zero but here the coolie we can consider that he is doing the work the reason is he is applying some force to carry this and the what will heavy load is making some displacement so the work done by him is positive and the work done by the gravity again is zero and as the angle is 90 degree the work done will be zero that means if the angle between the force and displacement is zero the work done will be positive and it will be maximum and if the angle between the force and displacement is 180 degree then the work done is negative if the angle between the force and displacement is 90 degree the work done will be uh, zero so these are the uh, three conditions uh, basing on the angle between the force and displacement and this is about the concept of work thank you